Hello students, in this video we are going to learn about below base method. So the numbers which are nearest to 100 or 1000. The numbers which are nearer to 100 or 1000 but less than the base. That means less than 100 and less than 1000. That numbers for square we are going to find here. Suppose someone asks to find 98 square or 96 square or 87 square so these all the numbers are nearer to 100 these are nearer to 100 but less than 100 so and uh, suppose 997 square 989 square 985 square these numbers are nearer to 1000 but less than 1000 so both the method will discuss so first what to do first below base but 100 one will do the numbers the numbers less than 100 their square we are going to find suppose it is given 98 square 98 square how to find first you have to find the difference between the base and the given number the given number is 98 here and the base is 100 we know that 98 is closer to 100 then the difference what is the difference 100 minus 98 that is 2 right so this difference plays an important role so what you have to do 98 minus 2 and thereafter 2 square you have to take the difference you have to subtract from the given number and thereafter its square you have to take okay what is the square of 2 4 but here our base is having two zeros so here we have to keep two digit that one you have to keep in mind you have to keep two digit here while balancing so now it is 96 and now it is 0 4 actually the square of 2 is 4 but if we write 964 then it is the wrong answer that's because our, our base is having two zero means two digit we need to keep in part if this is part one and this is part two then in the second part you have to keep two digit when the base is 100 now move to another question if it is given that 93 square same thing you have to do first what you have to do first find the difference find the difference of given number and base second subtract subtract the number from the given number that is part 1 and 3 take square of the difference squares of difference four step balance it so first what you have to do we have to find the relation 100 minus 93 that is how much 7 ok now 93 minus 7 the difference you need to subtract from the given number ok now 7 square how much 49 93 minus 7 how much 86 so 86 and 49 now what you have 86 49 this is the square of 93 so already we are having two digits here so we don't need to put any zero here we have got on only one digit so i put a zero before it in order to make it two digit number okay now if three digit number is coming three digit number is coming like suppose 86 square 86 square now what you have to do 86 is how much less than 100 86 is 14 less than 100 so what you have to do 86 minus 14 thereafter 14 square 14 square that is how much 196 and 86 minus 14 is how much 72 now as because we are having Put three digits here only we want two digits 
So out of these three digits, last two digits you have to keep. This is 96 and the remaining will be added to previous place. 1 the remain here. So 1 plus 72 that is 73. Answer is 7396. Three examples I have given. 98. Here the digit came. Oh, one digit came. So I put a 0 before it. Here 93. Two digit came. So you don't need to do anything. Simply you need to subtract the difference from the given number. And thereafter you have to take the square of the difference and you have to balance. Now here what? Here three digit number comes in part two. So now what I have to do? Last two digit I have to take. The rest of the digit it will be added to previous place. One more example I will give. Suppose 79 square it is. We have to find 79 is how much less than how much less than 100? 21 less than 100. It differs by 21. So 79 minus 21 and thereafter 21 square. 79 minus 21 how much? 58. And 21 square how much? 441. So last two digit you have to keep. 41. And 4 will be added to 58. That is how much? 6241. 6241. This is the answer. So now we got the process. As because why we are we are doing subtraction here is because the numbers are below the base 100 that's that's why in each number we are doing subtraction 93 7 less means 7 you need to subtract 98 2 less means 2 you need to subtract 86 14 less means 14 you have to subtract 79 21 less so 21 you have to subtract and that number square you, you need to take you can take the screenshot also now I will discuss about the numbers which are nearer to 1000. How to find its square below base 1000. Below base 1000 means 30. There you need to keep three digit. Means here you need to keep three digit. Suppose nine 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 square we need to find. Clearly the base is one thousand. It's because triple nine is nearer to thousand. You have to find the difference. What is the difference between triple nine and thousand? That is one only. The difference is one. So nine 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 minus one and one square you have to take. 1 square is what? 1 square is 1. 1 square is 1. But here we need to keep how many digit? 3 digit. That's because the base is 1000. That's because the base is 1000. So what you have to do? In order to do that, you need to keep 2 0 before it. Okay. Now, what will be the answer? Here 998 and here 001. Now, the answer is 998. 0, 0, 1. Your answer is 998001. So uh, when the base is 1000, you have to keep 3 digit in part 2, and when the base is 100, you have to keep 2 digit. If the base will be 10,000, you have to keep 4 digit. The base will be 1 lakh, then you have to keep 5 digit. So like this, it will increase 3 0 involvements, you have to keep 3 digit. Anyway. If one digit coming, then two zero you have to put. And if two digit coming, then one zero you have to put before it. If three digit coming, then no problem. Now, one more number will do. Suppose it is given nine hundred ninety one square. So how much it is less than thousand? It is nine less than thousand. So nine hundred ninety one minus nine and nine square. Nine square is what? Eighty one. 9 square is 81. 2 digit number. So what I have to do? I have to put a 0 before it in order to make it 3 digit. Clear? Now this is what 982. 991 minus 9, 982. The answer will be 982081. Answer will be 982081. So if you remember a square up to 1 to 30, then it will take very less time within 
for three to five second you will be able to do in your mind itself clear now one more number we'll do suppose it is 981 981 square how much is less than 1000 19 then what you have to do 19 you need to subtract I'm taking the difference here remember this one means this is 100 thousand minus triple nine this nine means thousand minus nine nine one this nineteen means one thousand minus nine eight one this is the difference as I told to you earlier in case of base hundred now what you have to do nineteen square you need to take nineteen square is how much that is three six one and it is how much 962 981 minus 19 is 962 your answer will be 962361 so three examples I have given here how many digit coming here only one digit clearly you can see one here only two digit but here three digit it is coming so it is complete means you don't need to put any zero before it so we want three digit here as because the base is thousand okay so now let us do some random numbers base base hundred base thousand whatever it is now do some random number. one more example i will explain uh, nearest to base thousand thereafter we do some numbers random numbers you can take a screenshot also Suppose we have to find 973 square. 973. The difference is how much? 27. Now 973 minus 27 and thereafter 27 square. 973 minus 27 is how much? 956. And 27 square is how much? 729. So the answer will be here we want three digit we got three digit also the answer will be nine five six seven two nine if you are getting three digit then you don't need to change anything if you are getting one digit or two digit they are like nine ninety seven square here the number is three less than the thousand so nine nine seven minus three then three square you got only one digit so now you have to put two zero before it this two zero you need to put otherwise your answer will be the wrong one nine nine four nine nine four zero zero nine this is the answer if it is coming two digit then you have to put you have to put one zero it's because we want three digit in case of base thousand now do some more numbers So, see, suppose it is given 98 square, 994 square, 82 square, 987, 80, 87, not 80, 989 square. So four numbers is given to us. Now how to do this? A single step. So what we have to do? Here minus two. 96 minus two. How much? 90, 98 minus two. 96 and two square. Four means zero four. Answer is nine six zero four. Here minus eighteen. Eighty four minus eighty two minus eighteen. How much? Sixty four. Sixty four. And 18 square how much? 324. So 3 you have to last two digit only you need to keep. I told to you 80, 84, 82 minus 82 minus 18 and thereafter 18 square. 18 square is 324. This is base 100. So two digit only we need. So here 6 2 it is coming, 6 4 it is coming. Sorry, 6 4 it is coming. Then you have to add 3. The remaining 3 will be added to previous place 6, 7, 2, 4. This is the answer. Clear? 
Now it is six less than the base. Nine ninety four. The base is thousand. So how much? Nine nine. Sorry, nine eight eight. Nine eight eight. Now six square is thirty six. But if the base is thousand, then we need to have three digit in part two. So nine eighty eight. It is first part. This is the second part. So zero three six. You need to keep. Now this one. It is eleven. Eleven less than the thousand. So how much? Nine eighty nine minus eleven. How much? Nine seven eight. And eleven square. How much? One two one. This is eleven square. Already we are having three digit. So this is all about below this squaring method. So by learning this, we will be able to find square which is nearer to one hundred and one thousand within a short period of time. So this is the end of this video. I hope after watching this video, you will be able to understand and you will be able to solve. all type of square means this type of square within quick time thank you for watching